thank you so much for watching my videos. Now, I am super excited because I have an awesome Dollar Tree haul for you guys. It's pretty big. I did pick up quite a bit of items. Now, um, the items I do not pick up, I always post on my Instagram, Sheep Coupons for Charity. I'm very close to hitting 4,000 followers. And once I hit 4,000 followers, I have an awesome giveaway plan for you guys. So if you're not following me on Instagram, you definitely should, Sheep Coupons for Charity. The link to follow me on Instagram will be in the description box. Now, um, I am having a Dollar Tree gift card giveaway, and that is in my Dollar Tree walkthrough. So if you have not checked out that walkthrough, I show a lot of the items. I did not pick up it is in the description box and I'll also link it at the end of the video so you guys can click on that and enter to win it's a Dollar Tree gift card and bonus gifts so let's go ahead and jump right into this Dollar Tree haul so I picked up quite a bit of items and the first thing that I saw that I was really excited about is the winter pine two scented with holder candles and it smells so good it smells like um, like the pine trees. So I was super excited. I thought this would be great for like either um, a charity gift basket or a basket I'm going to work on. So this is a dollar. Definitely picked it up. Thought that was a great deal. I also picked up some Christmas candles that they had and I had never seen these before. So I was super excited to find them. And so I picked up four of them. I did pick up one with the little um, Christmas stockings. And then when this one says it's the most wonderful time of the year. I thought they were really cute. I love the decor and they smell really good. And these are by, how, who are these by? Greenbrier, Greenbrier International. They are one wick and they're just really pretty. I really, really liked them. So I picked these two up. And then I also picked up these two and this one has the snowflakes and this one is kind of like the red truck theme that I'm trying to go with um, this year. So I picked these two up. Now I did pick up some toilet paper to add to that gift I was doing for the lady that's in hospice. So I picked up two packages of the four roll of the Cottonelle cleaning ripples. These are new at my DT. I have never seen them before and I was super excited. I was like, wow, they had Scott and now they have Cottonelle. That is a great deal for a dollar, especially if you're not a couponer. It's a great price. You're getting eight rolls for two bucks, which I don't think is a bad deal. And so I picked up two more just to add. I did have other toilet paper I'm adding to her gifts or stuff that I've already given her, but I thought extra is always nice. So let me pull out all the Christmas stuff and we'll go over that right now. They had a lot of really awesome Christmas items at the Dollar Tree, so let's go ahead and go over that first. Um, I did pick up two of these crosses. I thought they were super pretty, and I did show them in my walk full, walk through, walk full, because um, I was reading this at the same time. This one says, grateful, thankful, blessed. It does have the little thing right here where you can display it. And then this one is pretty heavy. It says, be still and know that I am God. And it has the Psalms on it. These are so pretty. Um, you guys know I do do, if you don't know, I run a nonprofit and I do speaking engagements to empower women and encourage them to keep on moving in life. A lot of these women have um, come out of different types of situations in their lives. So we always speak to them every month. Um, and just try to encourage them to keep on pushing. They're doing good, just keep pushing, try to learn how to coupon, all these different things. Anyways, that's in my charity videos if you guys are interested in seeing what exactly I do. But I did pick up two of these for like um, little grab bag goodies that I like to give away. So I only picked up two because I always end up picking up so much more during the month. So by the end of the month, I have plenty to make awesome bags. I did pick up this adorable Santa um, bucket and I'm going to use this for a Christmas gift. So I thought this was really cool and I love the little belt on it. It's pretty deep. So I love using these to make like little Christmas gifts out of. So I picked up one of those because I know they're probably gonna go fast and I will not be able to find them. I did pick up the ornament decorations and these are of the red truck. Oh, and I lost a tree already, guys. I'm kind of bummed. Um, there should be a tree here, but it must have fallen out in the bag because there's books and stuff in there. So hopefully I can glue it. Yeah, I should be able to hot glue it back on, but I love the little red trucks. I think they're so cute. And that's my Christmas theme this year. I am planning on getting my Christmas tree out like soon. I wanted to do it last week, but I got busy. And I need to do it because if I don't get that Christmas tree out, I will not have a tree. And I have not had a Christmas tree up in three years because of my nonprofit and being so busy. Now, I did pick up some signage to go with my little decor theme. And I picked up the red truck. It says home for the holidays. Really, really cute. It is on particle board, but I really, really like it. So um, I picked this one up and I might put some, do some Christmas stuff out here too as well. 
And then I also picked up this one, which is my favorite. I love this. And I've seen so many on the Facebook Dollar Tree, like so many reads and stuff you guys have done. And I'm like, so do you guys sell these? <laughs> because I, It's not that I don't want to make it. It's just finding the time to do it. But I would love, let me know, guys, if you're on um, that Dollar Tree Facebook page and you're watching this video and you are happen to be one of those people that made those reads. Um, I commented that I loved it. So if you guys are making these, let me know. And if they're for sale, let me know. Cause um, seriously, I would buy one <laughs> because I just don't have the time. I really wish I did. And I love this. It is particle board. I think it's really cute. I love the glitter detailing. Sorry, I'm taking so long showing you this one thing. I just, I wanted to get that out there just in case you guys are making them. Okay. I think that's it as far as, oh no. As far as Christmas, I did pick up two of the um, trailers because I have a lot of um, friends that have trailers too. Like a lot of times we go camping together. So um, I thought this would be cute to give to them with maybe some candies and some hot chocolate. So this one has just the trailer and I think it's really, really cute. And then this one has the trailer, Santa, and the um, snowman. So I think these are absolutely adorable. You don't have, you can just give it like this, or you can take it out and put like some candies or some hot chocolate or even some coffee in there. And that is a super cute gift. So I picked those two up because I really, really liked them. I thought they were cute. And I think that is everything. Nope keep saying that's everything that I got Christmas related no 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 I got a little bit more this is something else I'll show you guys in a second but um I did find this and um right now I don't know if you guys know this but a lot of people co-workers and stuff they probably have a lot of um fundraising going on so I did buy oh god I probably bought like four 25 dozen bake cookies so I don't have to do anything but just throw them in the oven and I thought you know what I'm gonna put them in here and I'm probably gonna take them to work and I think that would be really cute or I can use this to like give to my family or whatever put cookies and stuff in it and those cookies are super easy to make it's not from scratch you just basically throw them in the oven and I was gonna use this and it also has the red truck on it so I thought that was really cute so into this red truck this year I'm so excited about Christmas and I cannot wait for a lot more stuff to come out especially at the 99 because I did do a 99 cent store exclusive walkthrough so if you guys have not seen it with all their Christmas stuff I'll link that at the end of the video so you guys can check it out I don't know if you have a 99 but if you do it's a video you definitely want to watch because they have a lot of cute Christmas stuff coming out so I picked these up for my granddaughters um, I know that they're coming for Thanksgiving. I probably won't see them for Christmas. I get either or. Last year I got them for Christmas. I got them for New Year's. This year I'm getting them for Thanksgiving because my birthday is around Thanksgiving and that is one of my wishes to like have them for my birthday. So um, yeah, I thought this was super cute. So I picked this up for Lois and Lois is a little bit more boyish. Like she's a little bit more of a tomboy. So I thought she would really like this with the reindeer in the ears. And then Lana is my little princess, my little queen. So I did pick this up and I thought it was perfect for her. You know, kids love to dress up and I think every little girl should feel like a princess or a queen. And I just absolutely love it. I think it's adorable. And these were 99 cents as well. They had a ton of them at my store. A lot of them light, light up. A lot of them do different things, but I just think this is so adorable with a little, um, crown on it and it just looks like it has little faux diamonds. I thought this was super cute for her. So I picked that up and I think finally guys, that's it. Now I'm obsessed with these. Like this is only a three pack, um, but they used to be bigger. These are so good. These little Scooby snacks. Now the dogs think they're, my dogs actually think they're for them because they look just like the milk bones, but these are so cute. I know they're looking at me like, mom, why are you eating that? That's for us. So I picked up a three pack. I did eat one in line because the line was super long and I was starving. So, but I have two left and I'm actually gonna hide them for my husband because he likes them too. Now I saw Mama for Nicole do a review on these and I was just like, I have not seen these in my area. So I picked up three of them, one for a future giveaway. She showed a review and they worked excellent. One for a future giveaway, and then the other two I'll probably use for um, charity gift baskets. So these are the shadow switching sponge. It um it's a sponge cleaning tool that easily removes color from eyeshadow brushes, so they can be used to apply a new color. I saw her do the review, and I was like, oh my gosh, it really does work. So I picked up three. I thought that was a great deal for a dollar, and I love the little like um, decor in the front, like the little. Um, 
sticker they have up there. I think it's really cute, and I think that is a great buy for a dollar, especially since she did the review and it does work. So if you have not checked out Mama for Nicole, definitely check her out. She's a fellow YouTuber, and she does Dollar Tree hauls and vlogs and all kinds of fun stuff. Now, I did... Um, find the ice i read your guys's comments i know a lot of you guys don't think i do but i go through all of your comments at least i try to i know there's a lot of them and one of you were saying that they sell these ice nail polishes at the dollar tree so i did pick up four um i picked up three of them i'm sorry i picked up three because um i was saying in my cvs haul that i am doing a um 150 makeup bags for um, special needs kids that are going to have a prom next year. So I'm gathering stuff together already. So I make sure I have just enough when I do do my mass donation. So I picked up um, three of these, which is six nail polish and one will each go in one makeup bag. So I thought that was a great deal for only a dollar. And like you guys said, these are sold at Walmart and I did not know that. So I picked up two in, ooh, of course I dropped it in 966 and 1012 which is the pinkish mauvish color and the glitter blue and then i picked up one in 1005 and 1391 which is this blue and really pretty silver and so i picked these up i thought that's a great addition i know i've been picking up a lot of them on my cvs haul for 50 cents and it's pretty much basically the same price so i'm like i might as well get them there too now I did pick up two of these new LA Colors um, lip tins, and these are the lip balms in the macaroon. I think these are absolutely adorable. This is you are very sweet. This is meant to be, and I picked up one for a future giveaway and then one for a charity gift basket. So I thought that would be cute for you guys and for my little gift baskets I like to make. So one of each of these. I thought that was a great deal, and then. I also picked up one for a future giveaway and one for a charity gift basket. I picked up two of the uh, lip glosses and I really like these. I think they're really cute. You get quite a bit of lip gloss and I love that you can like put it in your bag or attach it to your backpack if you have a little one. These are great stocking stuffers too. If you guys see them and you got like a little tween, this would be absolutely perfect for them. And I thought, wow, what a great deal for only a dollar. So I picked up one in the unicorn and one in the llama. I like it. I think it's great for only a dollar. Pick those up. Now, oh, I'm telling you guys, like I need to stop with the notebooks. I still have a ton. I've been giving away a lot of them. I give away quite a few of them um, during this year, but I'm, it's not that I'm running low, but I still need to like keep up because I like putting inspirational um, notebooks in my backs, my little grab bags that I make. So this one says big plan, big plans. And I love the little gold leaf detailing. These are by Jot and they are lined. And I love the little gold wire right here. I think that's a great deal for only a dollar. And this one says, take note. I just really loved these notebooks. I think that's a great buy for only a dollar. So I picked this one up. This one is by Jot as well. And then this one says, approved, let's go traveling the world. So, and it has like a world map on it and it has the gold detailing as well. These are all lined guys. Great deal for only a dollar. I picked up this one that says, make it happen. And then I also picked one that says achieve your goals. So they either have to have like a, a cute little inspirational word or they just have to be really pretty or something that I'm like, oh, I really like that. And then I usually add it to my cart, which I should not do, which I do. Okay, I last couple of things that I picked up at the DT. I did pick up some um, cookbooks. So um, one of you had told me because I was looking at the Pokey cake books and out here, Pokey is like, um, it's a Japanese Hawaiian fusion, like rice and it has like raw fish in it and different things. I hope I'm saying that right. I hope I'm getting that right. Cause I don't really eat Pokey, but I know Amanda does. And I was like, Ooh, that's kind of weird. Like, but I ended up going back and buying the book because you're like, no, you poke holes in it and you put good stuff in it. And I was like, oh, I got to get that book. So this is the delicious pokey cakes. It's 80 super simple um, desserts with an extra flavor punch in each bite. So I picked this up. This retails for $19.99, guys. And I was looking through it and the recipes are not they're easy because you don't have to like make the cake mix from scratch and I'm like I'm not doing all that <laughs> so um I will be off of work soon so 
for Christmas break and stuff. So, and I got plans in the future and I'll let you guys know about that as it comes along. I'm still trying to work on things, but yeah, I thought the recipes were really, really simple. I know I can do something with this. So I did pick it up for future use. I can't do it right now, but maybe during Christmas break or Thanksgiving break or something, I can pop it out and give it a try. I picked this up for Sway to the 99 and he's gonna go to his Dollar Tree and see if he can find it. If he cannot find it, I will be sending this to him in his friend mail. So this is the Lookbook of Style, a cookbook of easy recipes. And it is um, gluten-free and vegan dishes. And he is a vegetarian. So I thought this is really cool. If he can't use it, then my daughter, my um, daughter-in-law, she is also a vegan. So I know she would be able to use it as well. And sometimes she posts pictures on Instagram and stuff. And I'm usually like, yay. <laughs> I don't eat a lot of meat, but it's just like her food is just like, oh, wow, I won't eat that. It's very vegan-y. So um, not that vegan's bad or anything. I do love a good vegetable and stuff like that. It's just she puts like some way out stuff and I'm like, oh, I don't know if I'd try that, but I will. I'll definitely will. She's cooking for Thanksgiving, so it's going to be an interesting Thanksgiving. But they have like brunches. They have pancakes. They got fruit salad. They got guacamole. Um, all kinds say gazpacho, all kinds of sweet treats, all kinds of different stuff that's either Sway to the 99, who's a fellow YouTuber, can try out, or my um, daughter-in-law. So I picked this up, and this retails for $19.99, super thick book. They have the best books at this Dollar Tree. So I picked that up, and then I did pick up 100 ways to use rotisserie chicken, because I buy one rotisserie chicken, I use maybe a quarter of it to make chicken salad and then I'm like what the heck do I do with this now I kind of like just either I throw it away or give I give some to the bird I know I feel weird giving her chicken sometimes because I'm like you're like a cannibal now <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry I just feel weird I'm just so you know blue and gold McCall's can pretty much eat everything except for avocado seeds apple seeds um, and chocolate. So they could pretty much eat everything. And I give her a variety of different stuff, like as little treats, just to see if she'll like it and try it out. She loves chicken. So anywho, I picked this up and this retailed for $21.99. I don't want you guys to be like, oh my God, Val. No, but yeah, I picked this up and it retails for $21.99. Super thick guys, great recipes. And luckily, they are not that difficult to make so i'll definitely be giving this a shot when i pick up my rotisserie chicken and i'm looking at it the next day going what the heck am i going to make with this i got a cookbook now so that is everything i think that's everything just making sure because i do that sometimes uh, that is everything that i picked up at the dollar tree now i hope you guys are having a fabulous blessed day thank you so much for taking the time out of your day to watch my videos now don't forget i'll link that video at uh that giveaway at the end of this video don't forget to follow me on instagram coupons for charity and i will be talking to you guys real soon thank you so much for watching bye